Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. In this video, we will be solving one very interesting rational equation for the real values of x. So, let us get started by writing our denominators. x plus 1 cannot be 0. x square plus x minus 1 cannot be 0. Now, I will take x over x plus 1 to the RHS. So, I can write x over 12 times x square plus x minus 1 whole cube equal to 1 minus x over x plus 1. Now we can write 1 as x plus 1 over x plus 1. Then we have minus x over x plus 1. Now denominator is same. I can write x plus 1 in the denominator. So, in the numerator it will be x plus 1 minus x. Now, we can cancel plus and minus x in the numerator. So, it will become 1 over x plus 1. And LHS is x over 12 times x square plus x minus 1 whole cube. Now I will multiply both sides with x plus 1 as x is not equal to negative 1. So we can cancel x plus 1 with x plus 1 in the RHS. So we can write our equation as x times x plus 1 over 12 times in the bracket x square plus x minus 1 whole cube equal to 1. Now we will multiply both sides with 12 also. So times 12 times 12. So this 12 and 12 will be cancelled out. We will get x times x plus 1 over x square plus x minus 1 whole cube equal to 12 or we can write x square plus x in the numerator and x square plus x minus 1 whole cube in the denominator equal to 12. Now we will consider x square plus x equal to u suppose. So our equation will be u over u minus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now I will subtract and add 1 in the numerator. And then we will split our numerator with respect to u minus 1 and with respect to plus 1. So I can write u minus 1 over u minus 1 whole cube plus 1 over u minus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now we can cancel here 1 u minus 1 from the denominator so it will be power 2. I can write 1 over u minus 1 whole square plus 1 over u minus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now we can write 1 over u minus 1 whole square plus 1 over u minus 1 whole cube equal to 12. Now we will consider 1 over u minus 1 equal to m suppose. So, our equation will be cubic in m, m square plus m cube equal to 12. Or we can write m cube plus m square minus 12 equal to 0. m cube plus m square minus 12 equal to 0. 
if i will simply plug in m equal to 1 will it satisfy no 1 cube is 1 1 square is also 1 minus 12 no it is not if i will plug in m equal to 2 so 2 cube is 8 2 square is 4 minus 12 yes 12 minus 12 is 0 so i can say m equal to 2 is one root of this cubic equation or we can say m minus 2 is a factor of this cubic equation so i can write m cube plus m square minus 12 equal to 0 as i will write m cube as m square times the factor m minus 2 so i have to compensate minus 2m square so i will write plus 2m square then we have m square minus 12 or we can write m square times m minus 2 plus 3m square minus 12 equal to 0 or we can write m square m minus 2 let's take 3 common so m square minus 4 equal to 0 now here we can apply difference of two squares m square minus 2 square so we can write m square m minus 2 plus 3 times m minus 2 times m plus 2 equal to 0 now m minus 2 is common out so we will write m square plus 3 times m plus 3 times 2 6 equal to 0 so from here we can conclude either m minus 2 will be equal to 0 or we can write our quadratic m square plus 3m plus 6 equal to 0. Let's solve both the equations. So I will write here m minus 2 equal to 0 and m square plus 3m plus 6 equal to 0. So from first equation we can write m will be equal to 2. Now the turn of quadratic equation. Here we will check only the discriminant value. So d will be equal to b square minus 4ac. b is coefficient of m. So I will write 3 square minus 4 times. a is coefficient of m square. So 1. c is constant. So 6. So this value will be 9. Here we will write 24. So our discriminant is negative 15. As we are getting discriminant negative, we will get complex solutions. So rejected. So we are going to accept m equal to 2 only. And m was our substitution. It was 1 over u minus 1 equal to 2. Now I will take reciprocal both sides. So I can switch numerator and denominator. u minus 1 will become half. Once I will add 1 to both sides, we will get u as 1 plus half. And it is equal to 3 over 2. And u was also one substitution. u was x square plus x. So I can write u equal to x square plus x equal to 3 over 2. Now I will multiply both sides with 4. So I will write 4 times x square plus x equal to 3 over 2 times 4. So I can cancel 4 with 2, it will be 2. So I can write LHS as 4x square plus 4x and RHS will be 3 times 2, 6. 
let's add one to both sides so i can write lhs as 4x square plus 4x plus 1 and rhs is 7 now left hand side it is one perfect square of 2x plus 1 and right hand side it is 7 now i will take the square root both sides so we will get 2x plus 1 equal to plus minus square root 7 subtract 1 from both sides 2x will become minus 1 plus minus square root 7 and once i will divide both sides by 2 we will get our answer minus 1 plus minus square root 7 over 2 i hope friends you will like this video thank you so very much for watching do not forget to like share subscribe till next video take care of yourself